because I have had a revelation. Divine inspiration, really. And I'm going to need your help to make it happen. This is how I discovered it. It was just before dawn, and I heard the sound of police cars and sirens and smashing glass. So I put on my rope and I went outside and I said, Officer, what on earth is happening here? And he said, there's a gang of young men going around smashing car windows with crowbars and taking everything of value out. Well, I said, of course that's terrible, but aren't you stereotyping? <laughs> Why is it always a gang of young men? And he said, you don't see gangs of grandmothers going around. So, 
just as this clock strikes noon, I am going to come in making a fashion splash, <laughs> and you will unplug your appliances and go up to the teller and hit the steam button. <laughs> <laughs> so the place fills with steam. That should terrify them. And, and I'm going to say in my meanest voice, I know that you remember the pain of being scorched when you were pressing your favorite blouse or your favorite pair of trousers. We wouldn't want that to happen today, would we? Idiot. And then, I just thought of this. This is so great. I love the way my mind works. It's just, okay, this is a brilliant idea. Then, I'm going to take the tapestry bag, put it on the counter, and say, the first one to get the money all the way to the top will win a creme boule. <laughs> <laughs> And when the police come screeching up to the curb, I'm just going to say, you better hurry in. There's bound to be a gang of young men in there somewhere. 